días, chicos. Este es el video para repasar las construcciones infinitivas. This is the video to review infinitive constructions. This is the video that uh, first and second period will be watching on Tuesday. First and second period will be watching on Tuesday. In order to participate in this video, everybody needs a whiteboard out, and they have divided it in half, long ways, horizontally. Okay, and at the top, you're going to label it AR conjugación. What is AR conjugación? AR conjugation. We're going to be conjugating a verb in the top part. And in the bottom half, you're going to label it construcción infinitiva. Construcción infinitiva. What's construcción infinitiva? Yeah, that a girl. Infinitive construction. We're going to be practicing infinitive construction on the bottom half. So you need a whiteboard and a marker. The other thing that you need is to have your Mi Vida out and open to your infinitive construction notes. Ladies and gentlemen, your infinitive construction notes are two pages long. And if you did not finish copying them with the sub last week, that was homework. And it's been, the notes have been on the blog for over a week. It's on Wednesday's class, Thursday's class, and I'll put them again on there today. Todo bien? Is that okay with everybody? Okay, so let's take a look at our, oops, sorry, I didn't mean to close it. Let's take a look at our notes. Our notes tell, um, say infinitive construction. So what is an infinitive construction? It's any combination of verbs that has a what in it. What does it have? What might an infinitive construction have in it? Bam, it'll have an infinitivo, right? Now, what is an infinitivo? Here we go. What is it, that vocab word? What does it mean? Absolutely, an unconjugated verb, and it means to do, to do something. Okay, it's not conjugated, and it means to do something. How many types of infinitives are there? Three, AR, ER, ER and IR. IR verbs, right? Okay, so whenever you have a combination of verbs, okay, we always conjugate the first one, and the second one we're going to leave as an infinitive, typically, okay? Because you, repite, nunca. 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 Nunca, nunca, nunca. Nunca. Conjugate two verbs in a row when you're using infinitive constructions. Because think about this. That would be like saying, I desire, I travel. I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say, I desire, I travel. I would say, I desire to travel. Okay? We need, we finish our homework. No, we need to finish our homework. So you leave that second verb as an infinitive always. Are we okay thus far? Okay? So an infinitive always means to do something, and it's an unconjugated verb. So you'll notice in the notes, I got all fancy pants, and everything in red is what? Look at all the red parts. Yo deseo, tu esperas, ella necesita, the part that's red is what? Is the conjugated verb. Absolutely. The part that's red, yo deseo, I desire, is the conjugated part. Okay? And in my notes, the green part is the infinitivo, right? That way we could kind of see that broken up. Okay? So our very first infinitive construction is desear plus an infinitivo. So, ¿qué significa desear? Joseph, ¿qué significa desear? Are you with me, kid? ¿Qué significa? What does desear mean? To desire. Desear means to desire, yes? So my example was yo deseo descansar hoy. What do I desire to do today? To rest. I desire to rest. Absolutely. Okay, so let's try one on our whiteboards. I want us to try, let's do you all formal on the top, you all formal desire. So on the top, you're going to do you all formal desire. And on the bottom, you guys are going to do you all formal desire to dance. You all formal desire to dance. And you all formal desire. Or actually, can I switch it on you? Sorry. On the top, can we do you all formal dance? You all formal dance. And then you all formal desire to dance on the bottom. And please make sure to write kind of big for the blind girl. 
And those of you who are doing this in class, please make sure to check your answers when I hold them up. So on the top, you all formal desire, or sorry, you all formal dance. Dang it, sorry, you all formal dance. Now, if it's you all formal, how's your verb going to have to end? Oh, us, ah, almost, ice, on. It's going to have to end in on. So it should be, how do you say you all formal? Ustedes. Ustedes, plural. Ustedes bailan. And then the bottom would be, repite todos. Ustedes, Ustedes. plural. Ustedes, Ustedes. Desean. desean bailar. Ustedes bailan. Todo bien? Okay, let's do another one. So the next one I looked at was esperar plus an infinitive. What does esperar plus an infinitive mean? To wait to do something or to hope to do something. To wait to do something or to hope to do something. So I said, tu esperas practicar deportes. You informal, what do you hope to do? To practice sports. Okay, so let's do another one. And let's say she, um, she, she returns. She returns on the top. How do you say to return? Baby, come back. Regresar. She returns. Is that, we use silence. My phone. She returns. And then on the bottom one, she hopes to return. And where she hoped to return from? From Mexico. There we go. She hopes to return from Mexico. So she returns. Baby, come back. Regresar is the verb. She returns. And then she hopes to return. And how do you say from Mexico? De Mexico, exactly. Absolutely. Check your conjugation for regresar. Okay. So you should have, can you see the whiteboard <laughs> clearly on here too? Okay. So we have repite todos. Ella regresa. Ella regresa. Ella espera regresar. De Mexico. And remember, those of you in the audience, you should be speaking Spanish. And if you're not, the substitute is totally going to write me a little note and say they were being bums and they didn't say anything. Okay? So please, por favor, participar. This is stuff that is all on the quiz. Okay? Next one. Let's see. We have necesitar plus an infinitive. Necesitar plus an infinitive is to... Huh? One more time. Need. Good morning, sunshines. To need. To need to do something. To need to do something. So what is it that we need to do? Eat breakfast. Okay. So on the top, AR conjugation, we eat breakfast. We eat breakfast. We eat breakfast. And on, so eat breakfast. Mm-hmm. 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 What is it? Desayunar. We eat breakfast, and then we need to eat breakfast. We need to eat breakfast. Como se dice? We need to eat breakfast. Will you get a new marker maybe that works? How about? Because right now you're not really participating, so let's make sure that we're on it. Remember that if you don't have a marker, and you can give one of my, check your endings, you can give one of my TAs a cell phone or car keys, wallets, those are the only three collaterals I take for a marker. So on our top one, for the we conjugation, if it's we, how does the AR verb have to end? <coughs> almost, absolutely. The we has to end in almost. And then how about... Nice. So we have, repite todos, nosotros desayunamos. Nosotros desayunamos. One more time, desayunamos. desayunamos. Nice, I love to hear your voices. Okay, now on the bottom one, 
Necessitar is probably one of the most evil ones. Okay, because first of all, how many C's are there? One. One. Okay, so repite todos. Nosotros. Ne. Ne. Se. Se. It's not ne se with an I, it's ne se with a an E right here. So it should be, everybody check your spelling, it's N E C E. Ne se. C. And how's it going to end? Tamos. Oh, repite. Necesitamos. 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 Desayunar. Desayunar. In huckleberries. Mm -hmm. You guys ever eaten at huckleberries before? They have really good breakfast. Okay. All right. Todo bien? Okay. Next one. We have de bear. Oh, we haven't done that one yet. We're going to skip over that for now. That's ER verb. Oh, okay, and the other ones are all ER verbs too. So we're just going to keep practicing with these three verbs right now. Okay, so, you informal, you informal desire to teach. You informal desire to teach is going to go on the bottom. You informal desire to teach is going to go on the bottom. And you informal teach is going to go on the top. You informal teach goes on the top. You informal teach goes on the bar, the top. You informal desire to teach goes on the bottom. Okay, if it's you informal, how does the AR verb have to end? O Os. It has to end in os, right? Os. So, we have repite todos. Tu deseas. Tu deseas. Tu deseas is you informal desire. How do I say you informal teach? Tu enseñas. Tu enseñas is what we are looking for. And remember, you have to be insane in the membrane to teach. Don't forget that enye on there, the tilde. Okay, repite. Tu enseñas. And in the bottom, we have, repite, tu deseas enseñar. Are you starting to understand this idea of infinitive constructions? Does it make a little bit of sense how to do this? Are we getting there? Okay, let's try another one. Let's do you all formal. Um, I know, it's okay. You all formal walk. You all formal walk. You all formal walk, and it's a whole group of you. You all formal. So how do I say you all formal? Ustedes. 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 You all formal walk. And on the bottom, you all formal hope to walk to the park if you want. <laughs> you all formal walk, and then you all formal hope. To walk. walk. Couldn't remember if I said the right thing for a second. Yeah, bam, that a girl. You all formal walk. Again, if it's you all formal, how does our verb have to end? Um. On, absolutely on. Okay. And then, so we have, repite todos. Ustedes caminan. Oh, that was so sad. I don't think anybody will be able to hear you tomorrow. Repite. Ustedes caminan. Ustedes caminan. That's a little better. Ustedes caminan. You all formal walk. And then we have repite. Ustedes esperan caminar. Ustedes esperan caminar. Así, muy bien. Okay, next one. Um, I... I search for, I search for, on the top, I search for, I search for, I can never remember where I park my car, so I have to take the bus, bus boost car, okay, I search for, on the bottom, I need to search for, I need to search for my bathroom pass, 
So you guys will all get new bathroom passes tomorrow in class. Okay? I need to search for mi pase, my pass. I need to search for. Okay, boards up when you have it so I can start checking them. Okay? We have, repite todos, yo busco. Make sure you didn't write buso. It's repite, yo busco. Yo necesito buscar. And everybody check your necesito. Is it N-E-C-E? All right, adios, have a good day.